All right, Brian, thank you. The coroner has identified the teenager killed in Thursday's deadly shooting on the city's near north side. Her name is Renaya Grundy. Meanwhile, IMPD is still investigating the details around what happened. Fox 59's Courtney Crown joins us in the studio with more from police on this. Yeah, guys, what we know is that there were actually three people in that car, including Renaya at the time of the shooting. Police are still trying to figure out what exactly led to her death. IMPD responded to the 3100 block of North Guilford Avenue just before 2.30 yesterday afternoon for a person down in the road. They didn't find anyone there, but saw a vehicle driving erratically away from the scene. Officers tell us they tried to stop the car, but it led them on a brief chase to 30th and College. Then two people got out and surrendered. One of them was shot in the foot. Then they say they found Renaya in the driver's seat with gunshot wounds. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. Police told our crews they need more information to confirm what happened here. Just trying to figure out exactly what led up to it is what's going to be crucial. You know, this is where we lean on our community. I know we lean on you guys a lot, but we need to work together as a team. Come on, Todd, Renaya was a part of the athlete Indy running team. The team shared these photos and videos of her. They say she was a leader, competitive, and also supportive. Her coaches and teammates called her a light and a hard worker. This is a video the team shared of her talking after her first race with athlete. I feel myself growing and being a better athlete every day. Like it's a lot of things that I never learned and never knew until I came to this team. Well, teens getting killed in Indy is on a disturbing upward trend. Coming up tonight at 5, we look at how many we've lost and the message advocates are sharing tonight. Aaliyah, Nick.